is up guys good morning it is wednesday august 2nd and i thought i would just kind of film a day in the life for you guys it is 7 a.m i woke up at 6 45 i already took the dogs out and now i'm doing like my little morning routine so i am getting my pure black sheila jack ready And also, my greens drink that I mix together in the morning. This label came off, but this is um, Species Nutrition Fiberlize. You didn't even see this one in my last video in my full day of eating because I was out of it. And I have it on auto ship um, with a bunch of other things. So, I just didn't worry about receiving it until I got it in. And then... Three scoops, so pour hard. I've talked about this product for a long time. I'm not sponsored by them. I'm sponsored by Zao Nutrition. But this is just a, a really great product. And then I do a scoop of BCAAs. This is my sponsor. I do have a 20% discount code. You can find it in the description below. The products are already very reasonably priced and you get 20 off of that. And then I do a scoop of deep greens. They've recently come out with a product called Daily Reds, Greens, and Blues, which when I finish this tub of deep greens, I'll probably start taking. And I'm going to make my aloe shot. I literally just do a shot glass, fill it with the aloe juice, and then do two tablespoons apple cider vinegar two tablespoons lemon juice or like it's more like a tablespoon and a half She looked up. And greens. Mm. I forgot if you put that fiber supplement in and you don't immediately drink it, it will thicken up. So, keep that in mind. It's not that it tastes bad. It just feels weird in my mouth. It feels slimy. All right, so now I'm going to get my protein ice cream ready. And I'll show you guys what that looks like. Ninja creamy container here. 
So, I do about eight ounces of unsweetened cashew milk. I love the cashew milk for contest prep. Um, it's like thick and creamy. I just like it better than almond milk. Now off season, I use unsweetened coconut milk. <clears throat> I gotta use this for some other stuff. Just kidding. All right, then we're gonna do a scoop of protein powder. And I've got one over here I've not tried. I'm gonna knock everything else down. And we're gonna try a blueberry muffin. And this one's by Nutribio. So, of course, it would be brand new, and I don't have it open. All right, so here's what I do for my protein ice cream, and I'll show you guys what it looks like tonight. We've got one scoop of protein powder going in. Now, we're gonna do One dropper of vanilla liquid stevia. And I am going to do, I don't know that I want butterscotch with this. Um, I just have vanilla somewhere. Sorry, that took a minute for me to decide. I thought I had a just a vanilla sugar-free jello, but I don't. So we're gonna do blueberry muffin and two tablespoons of sugar-free uh, instant jello cheesecake. It should still go pretty. throw a little bit of water on top and shake this baby up. You'll see a lot of people blending it. I just shake it. All right, and we're gonna pop the lid on. Set it in the freezer. to my protein coffee. So I already have some coffee made up over here. It's about two and a half cups. I make coffee like every two days. So I'm gonna put this in the microwave for three minutes. And in my shaker cup, again, we're gonna do eight ounces of almond milk. Not almond, sorry, cashew milk. Fill the rest with water. And we're gonna do one scoop. I think I've been calling this chic or chike. I don't know, whatever. I've used it for years though and I've always called it chic. But um, two scoops of that. And this flavor is the caramel iced coffee. And then I do one scoop again of Jean Nutrition Collagen. And in here, I'm going to do some salted caramel. Alright, 
So, use my mug. I was drinking out of tumblers before tumblers were cool. I have like five over there. So, um, pour my protein coffee mixture in here. And then I do put a little bit more water in here just to kind of get some of the residual off. Go a bit more. There we go. There's that. If you do a quick dump, you won't spill it. You just gotta pour it in. Alright. Coffee. Now it is on to breakfast. Now I normally have cream of rice in the morning, but today I'm gonna have oats because we have a container with just a little bit of oats left over here. And I feel the need to use it. So I'm gonna do half a cup of oats in here this morning and I'll probably use this over the next three days and finish it off so we can that container put some water in and these are old-fashioned oats so they do need to cook a little bit longer than your quick oats so I really fill the bowl up and then I put it on like three minutes. And while I'm doing that, I get my I get my dark chocolate square out and ready to go. And um, I've been having some extra carbs, so this is going to be a high carb day. So in my oats. One cereal bar. It's 100 calories. 18 grams of fat. No, sorry. <laughs> 100 calories, 3 grams of fat, 18 carbs. So, this is kind of my little extra carb use source that I've been using in my breakfast and my dinner meal where I have extra carbs throughout the day. So, while my oats are cooking, I'm going to break this up because I want to put it on top of my oats. Also going to be putting, I'm also going to be putting some sugar-free syrup in my oats as well. And while my oats are cooking, I'm going to take my supplements. So, in here, I've got two Pro Cleanse, again by Zhao. Uh, one ashwagandha, one uh, daily boost, that's your multivitamin, um, one DHEA, um, one, no, two DIM, and then, what is this one? Oh, two milk thistle, and then for my fat burner, um, I have a product from a company called GEC, and it's called TNT, and it will light you up. Uh, but that's what that is. So, um, I'm gonna go ahead and take... I also take some of their gummies in the morning, which I'm out of. They, um, have a shipment on the way to me. But I take the vitamin C, elderberry, and K2D3 gummies along with the gut guru gummies. Um, I've had a little bit of digestion issues this year for some reason. Um, never had digestion issues, um before but I did this year and so I really started focusing in on gut health and making sure that I keep it where it needs to be um, so that's why I do the shots in the morning so the aloe uh, I used to take a long time ago it's supposed to help with gut health the ACV and lemon um, that is as well. The Sheila Jat um, is just a pure gold resin. 
it's a pure gold resin mineral. I'm gonna break this up, put it in my oats now. And um, I thought I would, I tried it a long time ago, back in 2020 when I was working with Jamie Pender. Um, and I thought I would just try it again and kind of see how I felt, if I felt any different. Um, that was a really weird time in my life, so I wasn't feeling the best overall anyway, so I don't really know if it actually worked. <laughs> Um, so I'm going to take this religiously, um, until I use that whole container up, um, and see if I can tell any type of difference in how I feel. Alright, so I'm just breaking the cereal bar up now, putting it on top of my oats. Putting sugar-free syrup on top. And now splashing in my dark chocolate square. I just stick the dark chocolate square right in the middle and kind of like let it sit. All right, so there we go. And now I'm ready to sit down and eat and watch some YouTube and then I'll start getting ready for my day. All right, guys, here I am. Don't ask me why. I just like sitting on the floor in my living room at my coffee table on a pillow, laying back against the, the couch. And then I pull a blanket over. And, like, this is just kind of like my morning routine thing that I do. <laughs> um, and I will sit. Kitty will usually come up in my lap some. But I'll sit, I'll let my oats cool off, I'll sip on my coffee while I watch a little bit of YouTube and get to work answering client text messages and uh, responding to stuff on uh, Instagram, Facebook, and YouTube. See, here she goes. Which, by the way, <laughs> I've been getting so much hate on Facebook. Um... One of my reels, like, kind of blew up a little bit, and, and, <laughs> so many people were, like, telling me to eat a burger, or calling me a man, telling me I need to get a swimsuit that has tuck coverage, <laughs> dude, they're just, oh my god, it was hilarious. I don't take, I mean, it, it is kind of offensive, but I just sit back and laugh, because, I look at the people posting them, and I'm like, who the fuck are you? <laughs> and <clears throat> I'm also like, you know, I put myself out there, so um, I, you, can't, you have to take the good with the bad. Sometimes there's more bad than good. Sometimes there's more good than bad. But at the same time, I'm just like, what pleasure does it give you? to just comment hateful stuff on, you know, on someone you don't know, you've never met, um, and it's people who obviously know nothing about the sport of bodybuilding, um, it's just, it's funny, and then I got a comment yesterday on YouTube, I deleted it, because I don't get a ton of comments on YouTube, but, um, I posted my back and booty day, and someone commented, Trinny thing is possible. Like, Trin? Like, I would take Trin. <laughs> oh my god, people are so stupid. Um, and I, I honestly just sit back and laugh, and I'm like, go ahead, comment, give me more views, boost my stuff, get it out there. Somebody may watch it, and somebody may be inspired by it. I don't care if these people are, but if I can do that for one person, I'm gonna do it. Um, and I'm also, I just find it hilarious sometimes. I just think it's funny. So I'm just like, ugh, whatever. <laughs> and just to show you the final product, this is the oats. So half a cup of oats, some sugar-free syrup on top, 100 calorie cereal bar that says Cinnamon Toast Crunch, and one chocolate square in the middle melting. And then I've got my protein coffee right here with collagen. And that's meal one. All right, guys. <clears throat> it is now 8.47. And I am headed to the gym to true fit to train legs. Whoa, car. 
Um, I had started training in the mornings just because I've had so much suit work to do. So for those of you that don't know, I do own a suit design company, uh, Chiseled in Stone. You can um, uh, follow me on Instagram or whatnot. If you go to my personal page, you should be able to find my, my business page from there. Um, or I'll link it in the description below also, but it's Chiseled in Stone Suits. Um, I've been in business since 2012. I do not have a website. It's just me. I don't have a website because I don't want to get bombarded with orders. I do a lot of pre-made suits that I can alter and customize for clients um, that are at a discount. And then for those that want custom suits, depending on my workload, I can make a custom suit. But I've got like one, two, three, four custom suits that I've got to get finished no later than than Monday and I'm only working till Saturday so I've got these four suits I have got to get done which I can do it I'm I'm almost done with one I've started on another and I've got the basis made of another one I've just got to make the bottoms or stone up the bottoms and I should be good to go um, but I've had a lot of suit work to do, so I've been coming in um, early to the gym and training, and then my normal training time, which I would have during my breaks, which is between like 12.30 and 3, I've been using it to work on suits. Um, I could go and work in and work on suits and then leave and go train, but um, I've been trying to train at this gym morgue because it's just open. Um, it's got really good equipment, and I'm hoping that I might can grab some personal training clients from it. Um, even though they have personal trainers here, I know my prices pretty much beat everyone's prices when it comes to one-on-one -on -one training. Um, so, anyway, that is where we're at. I'm going to hit a leg workout. I'm not going to post it in this video. It will be posted on my shorts. So, yeah. I will catch you guys when I finish. Oh, I did drink my pre-workout. I didn't show it, but I had um, a scoop of cre yeah, a scoop of creatine, and then I had a Chemex um, by the Gorilla Chemist, his brand. I think that's what it's called. Um, I had his pump pre-workout, so. Um, I just mixed it with water, downed it before I left. I dropped the dogs off at the studio, and now I'm heading in to do this. So, I got legs, and then I got 30 minutes on the stair mill, so I'll catch you guys on the flip side. All right, guys, still rolling in with this uh, kind of like daily life log or whatever you want to call it. Um, working on a suit right now, laying stones down. Um, I... You guys know I suck at full days of eating. And then I just do one scoop of whey isolate mixed with water post-workout. So nothing fancy to show you guys. But I thought I would give you a little update real quick. I'm laying stones down on this suit. Here's another suit I've been working on. Um, so yeah, just working away here. All right, guys, it is Thursday now. Um, I didn't finish my vlog yesterday because I ended up getting super slammed um, with work and clients coming in. Um, once 3 o'clock hits, my day is pretty much packed until almost 6 o'clock with clients every like 20 minutes. So, yeah, there's that. So, I'm just going through my morning routine again. 
Um, it is a little bit different this morning because I do have to do cardio this morning. I'm training at my studio. I'm hitting shoulders, thighs, and tries today. Um, and I'm going to try to get there um, a little early so, again, I can get work on suits done. Um, because I have got to get these suits busted out. So, so yeah, that's where we're at on that. Um, uh, let's see. I don't know. Let me finish this up and then I'll check back in with you guys once I'm on the treadmill. What is up, guys? It is a humid and rainy day, and I feel like trash. Tired. I could not sleep last night. I didn't go to sleep until like uh, 1.30 and then I was up at like 3.30, 5.30 and then my alarm went off and ugh, it just, today is just one of those days where I do not want to do anything. bikini which I'm shipping to Malaysia no yeah and she needed European style bottoms also so I had to do bottoms for that and I've got to get that stoned up which I think I can get that finished today and I've got like eight suits I have to alter so yeah things be crazy but almost caught up on everything after I get those suits altered though, um, I should only have um, one kind of customized green suit that I need to do and have finished uh, before I leave for Romania. So <clears throat> yeah, that's where we're at. I am uh, I'm struggling so hard today. It's rough. R I'm a rough spot <laughs> but I'm gonna try to make it through after I finish with clients which I should be done by 1 or 1 15 I'll have a break until 3 45 um, and then uh, I should be able to like just work on altering suits during that time probably like put on a movie or a YouTube video or something and kind of watch it while I work on suits. Um, but yeah, I'm just, today I am just on the struggle bus hard. Get over. God, I hate people. People cannot drive. Um, I did do a check-in, so that's going to be in this video. My weight's kind of been up and down this week, which is weird. Um, I'll kind of go up two pounds and down two pounds. Or, I would say, yeah, around about two pounds. Up two pounds, down two pounds. Up two pounds, down two pounds. Almost like a, not even really a pound, like a pound and a half. Um, 
which could be digestion, it could be inflammation, because I have noticed that um, after leg day, my weight is up, so, but I'm not that concerned with it, like, usually when my weight's up, I'm fuller, but I'm still tighter, um, yeah, that's where I'm at with things, guys, so, just thought I'd give you an update real quick, this was supposed to be, like, a day in the life type of thing, but, my afternoons just get slammed, and then I forget to video, and all kinds of shit happens, so, it's just my life, I feel like that's, like, real life, um, so yeah, guys, that's kind of where we're at with things, I'm rambling at this point, I'm gonna go, I am gonna try my best to make it through this leg day, I've been trying to push really heavy on legs, but I think today, it's just gonna be a lighter leg day for me, because, I am barely making it free right now. Um, so I may just be doing some light legs and maybe on some of the like leg extensions and lying leg curls I push a little bit heavier instead of pushing heavier on like um, my squats, leg presses and lunges. So. And I have to do cardio afterwards. I've got to do 30 minutes of cardio on the stair mill, so there's that also. Uh, Alright guys, pray for me. I'll check back in with you when I'm done. What is up guys? Happy Friday. Um, uh, just doing a little check-in because I normally do Friday check-ins in the car. Um, I checked in with Ryan this morning. We have check-in video I'll post for you guys. I am not in the best of moods. I slept like trash. Um, could not go to sleep last night to save my life. Didn't go to bed till like 1.30. Was up like every two hours after that. My alarm went off. I think I got maybe like three and a half or four hours of sleep. And I do not function well on little sleep. Um, and I have legs today and cardio. It's okay though. So, um, heading in to hit these legs. Um, I am pulling up to True Fit. <clears throat> I have been trying to train here a couple of times a week. A couple of times out of the week. A couple of days out of the week. God bless. It would help if I could talk. Um, just to kind of get myself out of my workspace and give myself a little bit of a break from that. Uh, so, yeah, I'm struggling. I got legs, got to do cardio, but I'm going to get in here and get it done. Um, it's a dreary and rainy day, which just makes me want to do nothing but go home and lay down. But I got shit to do, so... Anyway, <sighs> hope you guys have a great day. I'll post that check-in video. Weight has been kind of fluctuating this week, about one and a half pounds. Some days up, some days down. Today I was down. Tomorrow I may be up. Who knows? But regardless, um, we're still really happy. Even if I'm up a pound and a half, I look fuller and I'm still just this tight, which is what we want. So... I'm kind of between like 125 and a half and 127. Like I've been floating back and forth in between there um, the past week. So whatever, as long as I still stay tight, I'm okay with whatever my weight does. Um, food has been up, but we've also, I think I've mentioned this before, we implemented cardio back in. So, I've been doing that, um, and I've been really hungry this week, um, so, that's a sign of prep, you should be hungry, <laughs> so, anyway guys, um, I'll post that check-in video, and I'll catch you on the flip side.